Now let's see how to create this 3D logo animation. First of all we insert our logo, then we press S for scale, and change the scale value to 58%. Make sure your logo is in center. Now select the logo and pre-compose it by Ctrl Shift C. We call it logo. Select logo, then go to layer menu, and select auto trace. You can change the tolerance value according to your logo. But in my case we use 2 pixel. Now hide the layer by click on eye icon. We create a new black solid for element 3D. Select solid layer, then go to effect menu, and select element 3D. Now go to custom layer, and change path layer 1 to logo. Click on Scene Setup, to open Element 3D. Click on Extrude to insert logo. Go to Tessellation, and Path Resolution set to Extreme. Now go to Presets, Bevels then click Physical, and select Gold Rim Style. We hide the grid by click on monitor icon. Now select shiny material, under extrusion model. Change extrude value to 1. Now select gold basic material. Go to presets. Click on material then select physicals, and select green light. Change extrude value to 1.20. Please do not forget, to download project file, from the link in the description. But only subscribers can download it. Now click on extrude to insert logo. We move the logo backward, so it is visible. Select bevel 1. And change extrude value to 1.25. Change expand edges to 0 0.76. Select bevel 1, and go to texture option and change the texture. Click on load texture to add the texture. You can download all the texture files, from the link in the description. But only subscribers can download this. Decrease occlusion texture opacity to 50%. Now change diffuse color to black. We duplicate the logo by Ctrl D, and move it to backward. We again duplicate the logo by Ctrl D, and move it to backward. Select bevel 1, and add green light material on it. Now we change extrude value to 2.35. We move it to center. Change expand edges to 0 0.90 and bevel size to 0. We are going to change illumination color to orange. You can set any color you want. It is a primary color of our logo. Now we adjust logo. Please like this video and subscribe my channel. Press bell icon for latest videos. We bring orange layer to down. Our logo is ready, you can add different material if you want. Select face layer, and right click, then auxiliary animation, select channel 1. Now select layer 2, and right click, then auxiliary animation, select channel 2. Now select layer 3, and right click, then auxiliary animation, select channel 3. 
select last layer, and right click, then auxiliary animation, select channel 4. We are going to add a plane for background by click on create option. We rotate it to 90 degree. We change the scale value. You can set according to choice, and move it to backward. Now we add metal material for background, from Pro Shaders 2 pack. If you do not have Pro Shaders pack, then can add any metal material. Now change UV repeat value to 5 on both side. Now select metal black material, then go down, change reflection value to 3%. Our logo is ready, now press OK to come back. Create a new composition, we call it noise. Now create a new solid for background. We also add turbulent noise effect on it. Now we change some setting of this effect. Alt click on evolution and type time multiply 300. Now our animation look like this. Now come back at element composition. We insert noise composition by drag and drop, and hide it. We come at element 3D, select custom texture maps, and change layer 1 to noise. Click on scene setup, now we select orange layer, and open texture option, select illumination texture. Now select custom layer 1. Click on OK. Our noise is add. Now we add environment on logo. We use basic 2K environment, but if you want to use different, then make sure it match with our logo color. Now go to render setting, and we turn on ambient occlusion, it gives more realistic look on logo. Right click and we add a new camera layer. Now press C to open camera tools, then adjust the camera by zoom and move tools. We have a good news, now we also available on Instagram, please follow us and support us on my Instagram page. Again we open scene setup. Now right click on background, reflect mode, then select mirror surface. Click OK to come back. Go to group 1, open O channel 1, 2. 3 and 4. Now we add position keyframes of channel 1. Add position keyframes of channel 2 and 4. Now press U4 keyframes setting. We select all keyframes and move it to forward, approx 4 second. Now we change channel 2 position value to 0.07. Change channel 1 position value to 0.15. Change channel 4 position value to 0.05. Now our animation look like this. Now we add glow effect on element 3D layer. We change glow threshold and glow radius value. Now we add new adjustment layer. We also add looks plugin on it. If you do not have looks plugin then do not worry. We use this plugin to just add cinematic look. Now we insert small particles video on it. Change its blend mode to screen. Right click, time then click on time stretch. Set new duration 8 second. Press T for opacity, add keyframe, then move it to forward, come back and change opacity value to 0%. We move channel 2 keyframe forward. Now our animation look like this. As you can see there is a yellow color in logo, so to remove this color, we increase the glow threshold value. Select camera layer, and add keyframes of position and point of interest. 
move forward approx 4 second and change camera position by pressing C. Please like this video and subscribe my channel. Press bell icon for latest videos. Now our animation look like this. Now the problem is light noise texture is not visible, so we change some setting of turbulent noise. The problem is solved light noise texture is visible. If you think your logo too dark, then you can use Curves effect, it can help you to adjust the darkness and brightness. I hope this tutorial, will help you, to make your own 3D epic, logo animation, please subscribe to our channel to motivate us, see you in next tutorial.